Roman cars. I clung to this world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. Don't tell me you're getting sentimental. I spent centuries here. You cannot imagine what I created. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. Sounds like you know each other. Lorman and I have a little history. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. Did you ever imagine the Sith would negotiate with a Jedi? I hope you're able to move beyond your prejudice. In the past, arrogance would have blinded us to our flaws. Now we understand admitting weakness is the first step in eliminating it. I urge you not to be so critical, Empress. The Sith Empire has always been glorious. I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. It may not be wise to split up. I can handle myself if she tries anything. Will you two be okay if I leave you with Lorman? It's Minister Lorman! Minister Lorman! Is that so hard to remember? Don't worry about us, Commander. Better than bowing down to the Eternal Empire, right? I remember when everyone used to bow down to us. Those days are gone. For now. of the alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. Is that all you want? Or are you looking for a way to get closer to me? The commander of the alliance is a tempting prospect. 
But this is purely a political offer. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. I want nothing to do with the Throne. You hardly have a choice. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. Engine's non-responsive. We need to bring it down. We're coming in too fast. Bail out! Skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. You handle yourself well in a fight. I can pilot a shuttle, too, unless someone sabotages it. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. Lorman's behind this. I know it. Lorman lacks both the courage and competence to orchestrate a direct attempt on my life. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. You handle yourself well in a fight. I can pilot a shuttle, too, unless someone sabotages it. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. If you wanted to get me all alone in the wilderness, you could have just asked. Normally, I arrange a more romantic setting for my crashes. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming.
forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed? Where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. Stay alert. Deadly predators stalk these wilds. You could say the same thing about your cities. City predators won't eat our remains. Usually. still work to do. There is still work to do. Storms are fierce today. It will make a rescue attempt difficult. I never liked relying on others to save me anyway. A sound philosophy, one the Sith Code embraces. Hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. You're going to pay for your employer's mistake. Good luck. The Geno Harridan don't go down easy. The Geno Harridan? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses.
for the Sith! Beacon destroyed, comm signal still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. Again, O'Haradon must have a camp nearby. We can ride out the storm there. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. Nothing like a little danger to get the heart racing. I admire your persistence, but... Let's focus on our survival, shall we? The beacon destroyed, comm signal still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. Even the weather is trying to kill us. We could take refuge in the Geno Haradon camp if we can find it. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. It won't be once we're done. destroyed, comm signal still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. The Geno Herodon must have a camp nearby. We can ride out the storm there. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. Look at this as an adventure. That is not reassuring. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners. Not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what he started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander.
part of me is enjoying this. As Empress, I'm rarely able to test my martial skills anymore. I prefer to lead by example. Stay on the front lines. Among the Sith, being on the front lines just makes it easier for someone to stab you in the back. That was too close. The lightning strikes can be deadly out here. If we recalibrate the electrical towers, they will draw in the power of the storm and keep us safe. I cannot decide which is stranger, that the Geno Haridan are real, or that they're hunting us. We should be flattered. The Geno Haridan only accept contracts worthy of their skills. This is one compliment I could do without.
fear the storm is getting worse. Good. It'll cover our approach to the Geno Herodin camp. I see why the Alliance follows you. Where others see problems, you see opportunity. Report. Any sign of the targets? No visual contact yet. Hard to track them through the storm. Rain's wiped out the trail. Keep looking. Find them before they find us. Found out why Grex Squad didn't check in. Lightning strike. Survivors? None. All of them cried to a crisp. Salvage whatever gear you can, and keep moving. Cena, the Alliance Command. No, our people. That means the targets are still out there. Find them! The shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's 
not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh, that Republic snake. I should have known Suresh was behind this. I've heard rumors she was working with the Geno Harridan. I had my suspicions. Suresh may no longer be Chancellor, but she maintains control over the Republic. Sure, there's another way out. You've got a pretty positive attitude about all this. Being Empress of the Sith and an optimist aren't mutually exclusive. Reports from Drome and Kaas claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious Outlander is missing. Odessin is not the target. held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. Why is it that all Sith believe they can live forever? Do not mistake me for the fools who seek immortality out of blind ego. Emperor of the Sith was my first face. But it is merely one of many I have worn. Clearly you weren't satisfied just being the Sith Emperor. The Sith Empire was too corrupted for me to save. But Sakul, Sakul was different. I saw potential in the primitive world, so I raised it to perfection. I see plenty of flaws in Zakul. The glory of the Eternal Empire has been tainted by my children. But it can be restored. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. Now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here to Odessin. Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the Alliance can last. There are rumors about the Commander. Remind them where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. Mr. Lawman warned us you might sneak off.
This reminds me of my earliest trials as an apprentice. Clearing vermin from tombs on Corivan. Sounds like you missed those days. It was a simpler time, but I am not nostalgic for the past. I see a glorious future for us both. I return! Ancient Sith Lords are revered on Droman Kass. But to move forward, we must abandon the old ways. Easy to say. Harder to do. I understand your skepticism, but I will prove myself to you in time. Don't you know it's rude to make me come out in a storm like this? We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. So you traded groveling to Asina for groveling to Suresh. You pathetic Lorman. It's Minister Lorman, and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. To Suresh, you're just a lackey. She'll turn on you the first chance she gets. The Alliance Commander is right. But if you surrender now and beg for mercy, I might let you live. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finished the job. I'm 
brought them right to you. Now finish them! Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage! Anything happens to me and they're dead! This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Oh, hello, Lawman. This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. Sounds like you had some excitement on your end. Nothing we couldn't handle. It's good to hear your voice. I knew you weren't dead. Never doubted it for a second. Suresh is behind this. Has she attempted to reach you? She's done more than that. Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on.
Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage. Anything happens to me and they're dead. This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. <laughs> This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. I'm glad you're both safe. You gave us quite a scare. It's good to hear your voice. I knew you weren't dead. Never doubted it for a second. Suresh is behind this. Has she attempted to reach you? She's done more than that. Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? It's time to embrace new methods, Empress. Be merciful, and you'll have a loyal servant for life. Unsatisfying, but I will try it your way. Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. There are dark times ahead, but fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. You know everything, then. I'll take that as a yes. It doesn't matter. The Alliance needs a leader like me. I saw an opportunity and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. What do we do with her? 
Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. That's the difference between us. You get to live, though you'll be in an Alliance prison for a long, long time. Take her away. You have no idea how happy I am. Empress Asina is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the war room. Never believed you were really dead, Commander. Not even for a second. Can't con a con artist, right? By the way, if anyone contacts you asking about a life insurance policy that paid out in your name, just say you don't know me, okay? Good to see you back in one piece, Commander. Don't know what the Alliance would do without you. And well, I can't believe I almost fell for Suresh's lies. Welcome home, Commander. Not right now. Should we do something dangerous? May the Force serve us well. Hey there. I apologize for everything on German Cuss, but I still believe we should unite your people with mine. You've proven yourself, Asina. I accept your offer. That doesn't mean you're home free. We're watching you. Knowing Thera, not even your hollow net activity is safe. Remind me to change my access codes. I look forward to working with you. We got your back, Radala. You okay? We've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Radala. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Koth. Looking forward to meeting you in person. Stress call from the gravestone. Koth doesn't call for help unless... He got lonely? He's in trouble. Answer the call. I'm trying, but the signal's jammed big time on the other end. Hold on. Got it. Mayday! Mayday! Is anybody there? We read you, Koth. What happened? 
Valen and Scorpio tricked their way on board. They've taken the bridge and my crew. You can't face them alone. Abandon ship while you can. I'm not leaving my people. Or the Gravestone. Got a few tricks of my own to keep them busy. Care to join the party? Lost him. But I have the coordinates. Failing, and nothing will stand between you and the Eternal Throne. Shields, weapons, and sensors remain offline. The Alliance fleet is hailing us. Father's little meat puppet. How are you? Just calling to make sure you're still there. I'll be right over. I've never appreciated how funny you are. Die with your feet if you like, but you'll never stand on this bridge again. We'll see about that. Should feel better now.
should feel better now. Feel better now. Should've not. It's a relief to see you in one piece. Told you I could handle myself, but we need to act fast. Remember the first time you let Scorpio on my ship? It got me thinking we needed a few modifications. 
The Omni Cannon, Sublight Engines, and Hyperdrive remain locked down. Ugh, I hate playing with broken toys. <sighs> but you can fix anything. Koth's encryption key is personal. I need to learn more about him to break it, but I can't access a HoloNet signal through the battle. You served with him. He must have told you things. Yes. This is going to hurt. But there's a hidden passcode behind the main one. No one knows but me. If Valen unlocks the bridge controls without it, we're in real trouble. You ever heard of a quantum bomb? Oh, Koth, you didn't. Anyone who doesn't enter that hidden passcode starts a countdown. Everything for thousands of kilometers around us. Boom. Half our fleet is outside. You should have warned us. I never figured on losing my ship with me alive, much less our fleet being that close. I came down here to disarm the bomb. Thought you might want to help. Valen's forces control the ship. I'll distract them. Go with Koth. Lana. You owe me a drink. I've got bomb fuses hidden on this deck. Come on. Some bomb was not my best idea. No. risk your lives.
One down. Let's not think about how many are left. this to protect the Alliance, not destroy our fleet. to be something else we can do. Quantum bomb was not my best idea. No, no. Better.
You... I never meant to risk your lives. to protect the Alliance, not destroy our fleet. Close. Just one more left. You're okay, Lynn. Just a little crispy on the edges. Yuri Pinky is based on Koth's war record. Soldiers under his command who died. Stand by. Bridge controls are unlocked. The gravestone is mine. We have lost five patrols in the lower decks, on opposite ends of the ship. Koth is not alone. Oh, father, you shouldn't have. That's all the fuses down here. The next stop is someplace exciting. <laughs> on the bridge with Thalen and Scorpio and my crew. Think how shocked they'll be to see us. Not much of a silver lining, but I'll take it. Let's hit the bridge. Almost done. Knew we could do this together.
You all right over there? We're alive. It took you long enough. I disabled the bomb fuse, but the bridge controls were already unlocked. My fault. I tried to resist, but Valen did things. She made me talk. I'm sorry. Consider yourself lucky to be alive. Lucky? Yeah. Doesn't make sense. They should have triggered the quantum bomb and killed us all. Quantum bomb? Get everyone to the escape pod. The only way we're alive is if they didn't use the console. What stopped them? Listen carefully. Time is short. You must have an excellent reason to show your face. We have the same objective. I manipulated Valen to leave the bridge so you could disarm your failsafe. You knew about that? I share your desire to save the gravestone. Stand by. Valen has cornered Lana Benico. You may wish to save her too. Why are you suddenly helping us? This vessel is the key to everything. Oh no. Valen and Lana are fighting where I hid the bomb. If they trigger it, we're all dead. Scorpio said you'd come. I owe her credit. Scorpio is manipulating you, just like your father is using me. They want us to destroy each other. Don't let them win. Oh, I... Hey! There's a bomb under your feet! You tear up this place, you'll set it off! We've got three minutes! I've waited long enough. 
If I slice open your skull, maybe father will spill out. Time to die, father. other brilliant plans? I am not finished. When I'm done with your precious Outlander, you and Mother are next. Such hatred. You are my daughter. We are family. You caged me like an animal! You were a danger to yourself and others. I made you safe. You feared what I would become, and you were right. Kill me, and your father will be free to take another form. It might be you. He's too weak, and he knows it. Kneel before the dragon of the cool. No! Oh, that's not... Did you think I locked you away to punish you? No. You had to learn. You had to be... conditioned. Kneel before the Dragon of Zakul! What did you do to me?! If you fight, you will die. Where's Valen? She's gone. No time to explain. I can't disarm the bomb with that shield in place. Take out the power relays.
That's it. Bomb over. The crisis may be averted, but my daughter still infests your shit. You did something to Valen. Shut down her power. Her aptitude with the Force made her extremely dangerous. Even as a child, there was only one solution. I conditioned her subconscious to respond to a simple phrase. Kneel before the dragon of Zakul. Speak these words in Valen's presence, and you activate her conditioning. She will be powerless to strike you. You're controlling Valen's mind. How could you do that to your own flesh and blood? If not for her conditioning, you would be dead, along with the rest of your allies. Now Valen's pride is wounded, her weakness exposed. She will be more dangerous than ever. I'm getting a signal from Theron. The Eternal Fleet jumped to hyperspace. It's just our ships out here. I've got reinforcements with me in the docking bay. Orders? Secure the bridge and don't take any chances. Alert me if you find Scorpio or Valen. Reinforcements! Hell yeah! And we didn't blow up! You ever pull a stunt like this again? The Gravestone gets a new captain. I'd like to see you try to replace me. Okay, point taken. This vessel is under my control. Organic beings have a few moments to abandon ship. After that, your lives are forfeit. Is that all I am to you? Another organic being you can't wait to get rid of? I have learned that the Gravestone, the Geminis, and the ships of your eternal fleet are all extensions of my technology. I must understand how we are connected. been after the gravestone from the beginning. I have been seeking answers, and this vessel is one of them. You betrayed me, like all the rest. I am unlocking hidden files and subroutines in the gravestone that are older than the Eternal Empire. Let us keep a little perspective. You want perspective? <laughs> Scorpio, where are you taking us? The Gravestone wants to go home. side of Scorpio or Valen. They can't leave the ship while it's in hyperspace. If they want to re-steal the gravestone, they'll have to come here. Wonderful. I'll make punch. The hyperdrive is locked. We're on this journey to the bitter end. Which is now. Sublight engines cutting in. Company! Lots of it! That's the whole Eternal Fleet! Valen and Scorpio's transport! It's getting away! Stay calm, scan the enemy ships. Are any preparing to attack? They haven't even raised shields. The transport is hailing us. Commander, I have made a wonderful discovery. The Gemini units, the Eternal Fleet of the Gravestone, they did not steal my technology. We are related. 
The Gravestone's computer revealed we were all created here, and you have aided our journey home. I promise to remember you kindly. If all this technology came from the same place, it changes everything we know about Zakul. Perhaps. But that is not your main concern right now. Valen and her remaining soldiers are sabotaging everything they can. You may wish to stop them. I'm seeing power surges all over. Shields, life support. The Omni Cannon. For whatever it is worth, I hope you survive. Cough! Help me fix the Omni Cannon. The rest of you, save the ship! <laughs> 